<laughs> rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Yes, we're back, sir. Hello. Good morning. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so for this video, we will be trying more hers chips. Yes. Chips. Are they chips? What They're kind of like che Cheeto, Cheeto, Corn the big puffs? fat Cheeto puffs. Yeah. yeah. Like right, elongated Cheeto, uh, Cheeto balls. Would you like to Anyways, uh, present okay. our snacks? Let's introduce our contestants. First off, by hers, we have grilled cheese and tomato soup. That's interesting. I'm not sure how this is going to taste like. It's a weird combination. You know what? It reminds me to a previous video where we did the Lay's flavor of China oh. and it was the tomato soup and chicken flavor. <laughs> Why am I talking like a robot? I don't know. Me either. <laughs> okay. Because it oh was. Oh my gosh. That was cruddy. All right, I'm going to crack this open, yes? Crack it open, sir. Whoa! It's so weird. Oh, I don't like your reaction to that. It's so weird. I, like, I don't know. I don't know what it tastes like. Oh my gosh. Oh god. The the first the first little hint I got was um, Parmesan cheese, like the stinky feet cheese. That's. A it, it's a milder milder version milder version of sweat sock smell <laughs> that's about right that's pretty accurate actually but de definitely um you can you get the tomato soup uh smell in there yeah um it does not smell pleasant no yeah so, uh, it looks but, like a cheetos puffs cheetos puff Cheers. Is there ghosts in here? No, I think it's just a door. Oh, yeah. okay. Oh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Fail. I mean, don't get me wrong. It definitely has uh, grilled cheese with tomato soup flavor. It tastes exactly what it smells like. Yeah, <laughs> but it's kind of a... Like, a, if the grilled cheese sandwich and the tomato soup was um, it gets made with powder and you add People water to it, it, I hate, I hate oh. um, <laughs> straight tomato soup. Okay. You think I like tomato soup? I hate that stuff. But it just gets, like, it gets more savory if you eat by eating it. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Your face is like, no, you're not going to make me do that. You know what? If I, I put a it, but I if I put a couple dabs of hot sauce on, I might be able to stomach it. Okay, but we'll see. Hmm, we might have to uh, take the on of that. Yeah. Okay. Next flavor should be slightly better. Buffalo style blue cheese flavor. Now, I'm not a fan of blue cheese, but um, some of these. And I want to show the back side. It's got a nice little red chili on it. So, oh, and it's got two red chilies on the front. That's awesome. So this has hope, sir. So this one I'm looking forward to because I do like blue cheese. Uh, Meg likes blue cheese as well. So um, there's this thing you can get at Costco, which is like the blue cheese uh, salad, and I'm a very big fan of it. Like, not like it's not for everybody. I understand. I mean, yeah. it's not for trend. That's okay. It's one of those flavors. Either you like it or you don't. There's no yeah. in between. So I <laughs> hope it's not like <clears throat> blue cheese forward. So you would at least appreciate it. The only way I'm gonna appreciate it is if it's spice forward. Mmm. <laughs> smell. Nothing. Barely. Barely. You see the inside of the bag? Not you know, not the chips. The the silver inside of the bag. It's like looks like tin. Yeah, that's pretty much what 
smell you get? <laughs> nothing. Nothing. Like a little bit of tinny kind of. There's nothing. Tin foil. And smell. the puffs are bigger. Puffs are bigger. Right? Yeah, slightly. these slightly. Slightly. It still smells like nothing. Lots of flavoring. You can see <sighs> granules. I'm absorbing it. And I can't smell anything. A bit of cheese. A, a, a bit of cheese when you like tiny, the, just stick yeah. it in your mouth there. I mean, and in your nose. Well, your I, nose I, I tell you what this isn't doing. When you hold it up to your nose and smell it, it's not activating the saliva glands inside my mouth. So there's like, my body's not even registering anything. Your body's like, it's not food. It's like, are you about to eat air, sir? <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. I taste the blue cheese. I taste the buffalo. In the end. Yeah, that's... Um, and it's very salty in the end. Yeah. It's a definite... Yeah, like buffalo-style wings. Um, very... For me, compared to other blue cheese snacks I've eaten, it's got a very... Very minimal blue cheese taste, but there is... There is a hint afterwards. Um, so for me, it's got mostly... Um, Buffalo style chicken wing mm -hmm. flavor to it. I agree. And a little hint of blue cheese after the fact. But not bad. Definitely better than the tomato mm -hmm. soup. Mm -hmm. um, and... For the spice, I want to say I feel a little bit lingering in my mouth, but it's not like it's not like jabbing you or anything. <clears throat> it's more like it's just a light coating. Like barely. You, you can barely like... Yeah. Like, I want to say spicy mayo is even spicier than this. I don't even get any spice. It, it's, it's very subtle. Yeah. Like, I wouldn't even, like, spice meter for this one is one. First one would be, like, negative five. <laughs> <laughs> negative five on flavor, too. <laughs> like, right now, I can feel it in my palate. I can feel it in my lower throat. And... Can you see it out the window? I don't know. I just heard a dog barking. Oh, okay. <laughs> um... So yeah, it's uh, it's very subtle. I I can't really, yeah, like it's like a one. No. Yeah. All right. Okay. <clears throat> Third one. I think this is gonna be my favorite. Hopefully, it's gonna have some spice on it. The crunchy cheese it x cheese tip cheese sticks. That's how you say it, I think. <laughs> oh, Lord. Uh, jalapeno flavor. And these ones are not going to be the big, thick, fluffy ones like that. These are the smaller, harder, crunchier ones. They look like the original Cheetos. Yep. Made with real cheese. Well, at least that's what it says on the pack. That's what they all say. Made with real fake powder cheese. Yep. That's how I, oh, that's what yeah. I was thinking, sir. <laughs> oh. Has an expiration date. Chips don't expire. Come on. Ooh. That's what we're looking for. Right away it like mm. you you get that jalapeno <clears throat> powder. Yep. So I am looking for mm. a, a like a little bit of a sourness to it. The spiciness for sure. You can see the inside. There's, um, they're very, okay, this almost looks like it's got white cheese hmm? coating on cheese. it and, and orange cheese because they're very light inside. Oh, well, let's grab them. Grab and try and see what happens. If you individually like smell it, it doesn't smell like anything much. No. I'm excited. I'm just going to... Oh, yeah. There, I picked a good one. There's uh, lots of looks like what jalapeno powder flakes on it. Hopefully this is good. Spices. 
It's got a bit of a crunch on it. It's uh, mm. harder than usual. Holy moly. That has got... I think I picked... I think I got the best one out of the bag. That one had a... Just after two seconds of crunching on it, you just... I just got this huge explosion of jalapeno mm -hmm. flavoring in my mouth. This is good. This is really but good. I have to say one thing though. Let me try a different one just to see. Give me one second. Yep, definite. And it's the um it's the cooked jalapeno flavor, not the raw jalapeno flavor you're getting. <clears throat> Now, one thing, this aftertaste I get, and I can tell that these things were just coated with cheap powder, <laughs> is I get a dusty, kind of sawdusty aftertaste. Do you get that? Like kind of, almost... Uh, I thought it was from the cheese puff, uh, like uh, the uh, thing itself, like the, yeah. well, the chip. And don't but get I don't me wrong. think it's the powdered coating of the cheese, though. No, but... <clears throat> it, I'm going to suck on it. It could be from the jalapeno powder, too, but it's definitely like... Um, almost like a, a stale kind of... Oh, yeah, like the powder is kind of gritty. Yeah, yeah, I get you now. Yeah. I mean, I just found it out from sucking it. <laughs> <laughs> don't say that too many times. <laughs> okay. Mm. Yeah, I understand now. Yeah. Like it is a good flavor. It's like a dense powder. Yeah, really dense, like almost like um almost like if you were to have a little bit of cheese powder and a little bit of just plain flour. Put it on your finger and put it in your mouth. It's good kinda, though. Yeah. Personally, yeah. I think everybody's familiar with Flamin' Hot Cheetos, regular Cheetos, all yeah. that stuff. If you want to try something different, but you're sort of craving that Cheetos consistency, like the original one like these, then I would highly recommend this one. Because it, like, it's not as hot as the Flaming Hot, but there are layers of flavoring to it compared mm. to the Flaming Hot, where it's like... You get the powdered cheese that they always have, plus like the spiciness, and that's it. This has multiple layers of flavoring. Yeah, most definitely. And I want to say, like, texture profile, there is also a lot of differences in there. Yeah. But, in the end, it's very reminiscent of what you get for, like, a, a Cheetos, if you want to compare it to Cheetos. Yeah. It's good. It's good. Here, sir. This is how long these chips last. Manufacturer date, November 10th, 2021. Expiry date, November 13th, 2022. One year and three days. One year and three days. Got well, it's not going to last one year and three days. That's No, sure. not now that it's open. <laughs> this is good stuff. This is good stuff. Yeah. Well, thanks for joining us, guys. All right. Thank you. See you next episode. You betcha. Yeah. <laughs>